Hello everybody, this is Stringer back to kick off the semi-final round for the African Assault Tournament. And yes, we got three matches to go through here, but only one of our competitors in this video will make it to that final three. So let's find out who will get there. So how this will work, I'll explain real quick. So each of these guys that got, won the, that got through the first round will play each other once, and whoever secures the most points will go through, and then the other two will go home. The matchups will go as follows. So, up first, we will see Spiny versus Delta Dromius. Then, we will see Delta Dromius versus Eocarcaria. And then, Eocarcaria versus Spiny. Right, and without further ado, let's go on with the first match. And for Slash. Skip. <laughs> In the red corner, as you can see there, we got Spiny. Spiny did pretty well in his opening match against the Kark. And I'd probably say, given the fact there's a water type, I would say it has a favourable chance of getting through to the final. Because Spiny didn't quite happen for Spiny in a water washout tournament. Anyway, in the blue corner, we have the Delta Dromius. Delta Dromius, well, wasn't really tested against Alpha Ranosaurus, since it had quite a strong advantage over it. But I would probably say he's going to have a tough time in this matchup, especially when he faces the Eo Karkiri. So I think if the Delta Dromius can get a win here, that definitely boosts its chances of going through. Ooh, gets a crack. Starting strong. No, 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 no. Whoops. <laughs> oh, I got stuck. I got stuck to it. Well, it's Delta Dromia starting off with a bang. We're getting two crits in a row on Spiny. Ooh, but Spiny finally hits back. First attack of the match. Ooh, is that going to be it for Delta Dromia? Well, a tie's pretty much going to win it for him. Give him the 1-0 lead, that is. Okay, yeah, there it is. A 1-0 lead secured for Delta Dromius. But it's not over yet for Spiny. It is the best out of three, so he can still turn this around as we move on to round two. Alpha Slash, we win the Alpha Arena. Could that be the terrain advantage Spiny needs? Boom, boom, boom. Boom. Speaking of terrain advantage, there might be a very interesting stipulation I have planned in the future. Oh, I can skip all that. <laughs> Bum, bum, bum. All right, Delta Dromius, let's see what you got, pal. Bum, 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 bum. Right, ooh, starting with a paper. And it's Spiny getting the first hit. Tappy Jara dive to come. Ty, but Ty will suit the Delta Dromius because of this. It's Sonic Blast time. Sonic Blast, we finally find out what it does. And I've completely forgotten. <laughs> but yeah, we finally find out what it does thanks to the lovely Dinosaur King community. Another Ty, another Sonic Blast! Ooh, Delta the Dromius landing them blast, blowing Spiny away. As I said at the start, I think this is a crucial match for Delta the Dromius. I think he needs to win this one to give himself a good chance of getting out of this, getting to the final. Because his next opponent is Yokakiri. Okay, no Sonic Blast this time, but Spiny on the brink of defeat. Oh, yeah, there it is. Wow. Even with the terrain advantage, Spiny just couldn't win. And, unlike the anime, Delta Dromius reigns supreme. Getting a bit of payback there, Delta Dromius? Right. That is three points for Delta Dromius. All he needs now is at least a draw, and he will secure a place in the final. Right then, in the red corner, 
we have the, Del the return of the Delta the Dromius. Fresh off his victory over Spiny, all he needs is at least a draw in this matchup, and he will go for it. Bum, bum, bum. Okay, we can skip that because we've already seen this guy earlier. However, it will be a tougher match this time because in the blue corner, it's Eokarkiria. Well, for Spiny to have any hope of qualifying from this round, he needs Eokarkiria to win. Of course, then, all Eokarkiria need, would need then is a draw. And he will go through, so there's plenty at stake here. This could be a very decisive match. And it's Delta Drum is starting strong. But yeah, look at that. The type advantage there. Stopping Eokarkiria from taking too much damage. However, this blazing spin attack is going to rip out the Dromius a new one. Whee! Whoosh, 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 whoosh. And he's got Flare Sword as well. We, haven't, we have yet to see it in this tournament. Defense boost coming in. Oh, speak of the devil. That was a big hit from Eokarkiria there. Flare Sword and a blazing spin. And dealt the Dromius, look at that. Not even a crit and it did all that. Okay, Sonic Blast is probably dealt as only hope here of getting anything out of this matchup. Okay, he got a hit. The tiebreaker will definitely help him. But again, look at that. And that's with defense boost as well. Pitiful amount of damage. He needs a crit. Well, Eokarkiria gets his crit off instead and takes a 1-0 lead. Yeah, no surprise there. Type advantage was really off prominent there. Right, let's move on to our second matchup, shall we? Right, round two, and yes, I changed the max because Laura was getting on my nerves. Can the Eokarkiria scorch its way to victory, or will the Delta Dromius come back into this? Well, Delta Dromius needs to win at least one round, one round against the Eokar. And you're not going to win many going for paper all the time, are you, buddy? He needs crits on the board. Eokarkiria will eat those hits up all day long. Oh, it might be. Another hit from Delta Dromius there, but again, very little damage. Oops, a tie. Now, ties do suit Delta Dromius because of the Sonic Blast and it is charge type. Okay, this is much more like it from Delta Dromius. Getting that tiebreaker, getting that crit block, guaranteeing himself at least the next hit. Well, he'll do tie damage, which is more than what the paper does. Of course, not the worst case scenario for Eokark, because Delta Dromius has to go for paper. So even if Eokarkiria gets hit, which it does, it won't take much damage. Oh, it's another tie, but Tappy Jar is coming in. Tide recovery effect there. Another tie. One more tie. Ooh, maybe not actually. Oh, Eokarkiria gets a crit. Now look at the difference. Eok this is his first hit in the match. Big damage dealt. And a flare sword to come. Whoosh. I mean, defense boost is going to do nothing. But look at that. From one hit, Eokarkiria has leveled the score. Well, has leveled things up. Ooh, but despite that, it's Delta Dromius even in the score. A crucial win that could be for Delta Dromius here. So you know what that means. This matchup is going to go to a deciding round. Right then, deciding round between these two. Can the Delta Dromius pull this off? A win or a draw guarantees Delta Dromius' place in the final and knocks out Eokarkiria and Spiny. Which basically renders the up next matchup kind of pointless. <laughs> but we'll still do it. Well, with a start like that, I don't think Delta Dromius is going to win. Eokarkiria landing a big blow. It's blazing spin attack. And well, with the flare sword on top, we saw how much damage it did before. 
Okay, no flare sword this time. Oof, saving grace for the Delta there. Oh, that's a tie. Like I said, tie suit Delta Drum, yes. Okay, yeah, last game. Eocarcaria, quick as a wink, denying Delta Dromius a place in the final. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Yeah, no chance he was going to survive that. Wow. Unlike the second matchup between these two, a very quick and easy win for Eocarcaria. So that means Delta Dromius has won and Eocarcaria has won, which means it can all come down to this final match between Eocarcaria and Spiny. Right, well, we'll skip this bit since we've seen these two guys already. But in the red corner, it's Eocarcaria and... I'm a dumb dum dum. <laughs> no, no, no. I, I forgot. I, I forgot. I still need to take screenshots of these guys. I shouldn't have skipped. Oh well. We got Eo, Eo Karkiria in the right corner and Eo and Spiny in the blue corner. Oh, we start with a tie. Okay, now Ty's probably suit favourite Eocark area because of the Ty recovery effect. But, unlike the other matchups, Eocark area will have the tight disadvantage this time. Could that make the difference? Okay, so stipulation time. If Spiny wins this matchup, then, um. I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> if Eocark area gets at least a draw or a win, then Eocark area will go for it. A shockwave effect there affecting the Yokark area, which means Spiny will be going for rock. And as will the Yokark area. Like, honestly, for the sake of making things easier, I hope the Yokark area wins. Please win. Well, he defeated St. Eusaurus in the first round, let's not forget. The Yokark area has experience dealing with water dinosaurs. Spiny is an entirely different proposition. Ooh. Well, I don't think it's going to be fatal, but it's going to leave Spiny on low health. And in fact, the Flare Sword might actually finish it. Ooh, we are going to see Flare Sword, and that should be curtains for Spiny. Well, that is a first round win for Eocarcaria. All he needs now is at least a win and a draw, or a draw, and he will go through to the final. Well, it could all end here. Eocarcaria can secure his place in the final, or Spiny could get back into this. Hmm. Oh, it's a, this could be a good one for water dinosaurs. <laughs> we'll say Spiny has terrain advantage here. Kind of on a beach, she's surrounded by a bit of water. You kind of have, yeah. This would be good terrain advantage for water dinosaurs. Oh, yeah, side water, whatever. But will terrain advantage be enough to stop the old Karkiris? Wow, he's getting loads of tie recoveries. Oh, is that correct? Eocarcaria is starting strong. But yeah, look at that type advantage though, keeping Spiny from taking major damage. Oh, another crit. Oh, it's, it's, I think this might be curtains for Spiny. Eocarcaria on top early on. But again, that type advantage could help, will help Spiny if he can take advantage of it. I'm, uh no 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 I think it's I think he's done. If a flare sword activates, he's done. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Okay, flare sword does not activate. Spiny is still in this eocark area on the brink of the finale. And wow, oh wow, wow. Dominant display by Eocarcaria, and he takes his place in the final. 
So Eo Karkaria, the first dinosaur to make it to that final three. As for Sinia Delta Dromius, well, didn't quite happen. So let's have a look at the final table, shall we? Yeah, quite interesting. I, I'm surprised Spiny didn't win a match. I thought Spiny would fare a lot better than it did, but it just really couldn't get going at all. Especially against the Eocarcaria, who absolutely sucked. Dealt the Dromius, got a respect, got, got a crucial win, but just fell short against Eocarcaria, and then, well, Eocarcaria, the door was opened when Spiny got beat by the Delta Dromius. The door was open for him, and he took advantage. So it is Eocarcaria out of this bracket going through to the final. But who will join him? You'll have to wait and see in the next session. And until that next session, this is Stream Gamer signing out.